Hey guys, we want you to take your show here, or you watch watching Nick, and today we're back with episode 9 of Let's, or it's not Let's Build, why did I say Let's Build? It's my secret Hunger Games map, episode 9, we're almost at the double digits, today, ta-da, look at this, we built the tents, the little tent corner that I wanted to do, I finally did it today, last minute again, on Thursday, uh, <laughs> I had other things, I was busy man, so I just fixed it up today, build a nice medieval wall I think it turned out well and I build the tent design which has a little bed in it and a, some torches and a carpet inside so I think it turned out amazing I want a tree I think in the middle or like a big building I, I, I think I could put the tree at the corner here like a, or I could build another tent there but I want a tree maybe like a really tall building in the in the middle here I just didn't have time today because I have to work later today and I don't feel like recording at nighttime. So, uh, yeah, it, honestly, it turned out amazing. The, it, well, I'll show you guys what it looks like on the map, little tent corner. Oh, where's my hand? There you go. Yeah, it looked amazing. You can see it on the map. Also, besides that tent corner, I think it looked amazing. Don't get me wrong. It looks awesome. Also, I have filled up the water a little bit higher now. So it actually looks more realistic. You know how the water used to go all the way down to like the, the first level, if you like? Look at that, I raised up the water. It's about over halfway, so now you can actually swim. Remember the water, it used to touch just this level, like the sea level? Yeah, now you can actually swim inside the water, which I think is amazing. You go, ooh, swim. You can swim in the water. Look at that, you swim, you swim. I think it's amazing. <laughs> I'm not a really good swimmer, but Look at that. I think the water, it, it looks so much more realistic like that when the water's raised up like that. What I had to do was, I just grabbed the piece of grass on that level, basically filled it out, pretty much everything, put water on top, and then I had to break each individual block. And then that, the, there you go. And I had to break everything. It didn't take too long. Maybe it took like, I didn't do everything in one sitting, but it did take a little while. But it was like an hour probably in tops, an hour, two hours. Not all in one sitting though. But I think the water looks more realistic now. You get the splash in it now. Um, I think it looks amazing like that. You get the swim down in the water. There might be chests underneath here. Um, you can't breathe. Oh, you can't breathe in here, can you? If I was in survival. Oh, my HUD bar is not even on. Yeah, I'm breathing right here. I could breathe. But you get the swim now, which I think is amazing. A nice feature that we can add. And then the swim out. If you're in survival playing the Hunger Games, I think to swim out the most realistic way is to swim up this like water stream up here. Yeah, water stream. Boo. There we go. But anyway, guys, I think that's all I have for you today. That's all, pretty much all the updates. It's all still empty around here. But we're slowly there. But I like the water rise. A lot of you guys were like, oh, raise the water. I think it would look 100% it look 100% better and it was definitely worth it it did take a little while but it was definitely worth it but the main part today was the camps the the tents in the corner I think it turned out amazing yeah that it honestly looks amazing it's not finished yet I'll finish it another day but for now we're just gonna leave it like this I didn't have time today that's why I'll finish it off tomorrow or whatever by next episode you'll see like a building in the middle it would look more complete but anyway guys, that's pretty much wrap. We keep these videos under five minutes or 